man, it's so weird to see myself without a hat. It is Friday night, it's about 5.30, and I'm going on a date with my wife. We actually did a date night last week, so it's two date nights in two weeks, which is highly unusual. We rarely get to do this. But we're gonna go out to dinner at Tsukasa, and I'm gonna take you guys along because after that, we are going to uh, the car show, not car show, the auto show. Uh, I went to the car show with Daryl Jr., so they have classics and all that. This is the auto show, and my daughter, one of my daughters, will be turning 18 next year, and we're gonna get rid of our minivan. So we're getting older, and we're growing out of the minivan stage, which is hard to believe. I still remember growing into the minivan stage, which wasn't great. But now we're growing out of it. We're gonna take you guys to the auto show, and uh, my wife's gonna look around, and tonight we're gonna try to decide on what car she wants after the minivan. Are you ready? I am ready. Is this exciting? Oh, I'm so excited. <laughs> okay, let's go. All right, here we go in the old minivan. Not for much longer though. All right, we're here again, Sukasa. You've never been here, right? No. <laughs> wow. I've been here I've like a it. lot of times. A lot of people have seen it now. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe that's why it's always that's so true. busy. <laughs> I need to be quiet about the best kept secret in town. The best Mexican restaurant in town. Yep, this is the famous machine. It's got new toys in it though. Except for that thing. That thing was here last time. Nobody's ever going to get that. I got it all. Put that in there. Maybe I'll get you something special for our date. <laughs> for my birthday? Yeah, out of okay. this machine. Oh, I'll get it. I saw these kids, how they do it. You think that it's one? Just not a good, I think this bear's leg. Yeah. No, not. You got to get that one in between the legs. Uh, let's just try. Oh, it's close. Oh, no, 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 stay. Yeah. Yes. It only costs a dollar. See? Thank <laughs> you. All right, we're in. We gotta eat fast. We're not gonna have a lot of time at the auto show otherwise. Enjoy your meal, guys. Thank you so much. No All right, we gotta eat quick. We'll just order right away. Yeah. We're both gonna get taco salads and a shrimp cocktail. They give you chips and salsa, and these are the kind of chips that are like kind of flaky and they're warm. They're so good. Salsa's super good. It's probably too spicy for you, right? It's a little spicy. It's a little spicy. It's it good is. for me. Yeah. yeah. Look what they just brought. You like shrimp? This is so, yes. These this are the best. Fancy. These are the best shrimp cocktails ever. <laughs> we got our food like super fast. I got a, I got a taco salad with steak. Just got a taco salad with ground beef. That was fast. We got in and out really quick, yeah. which was great. I destroyed everything on my plate. If I'm only doing one cheat meal, I'm not leaving anything on my plate. All right, we're off to the auto show. You ready? Yeah. All right. Man, that guy dresses fancy. <laughs> this is the Hilton. Hilton Hotel. Yeah, we came to the auto show like 30 years ago. <laughs> Not that long ago. I know. <laughs> we were thinking like my F350, the 2000 or 2001, might have been in the auto show the last time we came. That means we're getting really old. I don't know how much it is to even get in, but you're loaded, so we're good. 
Look at this concrete. That's a lot of work. Small squares, colored concrete, drains. Is that what you were thinking too? Not really. Not really. That was easy. No, this is just like, these are just classics. This is really not what we're looking for. Not looking for an old Ferrari or a 72 Nova twin turb skis. I don't know, I think you might, you might like this more than you think once that boost kicks in. All right, this is not the room we're looking for. I'm not a huge fan of these cars. I haven't heard a lot of good things about them. I mean, they're pretty. They look nice. Oh, really? You haven't heard good things about them? No. Like about their reliability? You know, you have to, you have to leave the rooms. Do you have any Lamborghinis? I'm sorry? Do you have any Lamborghinis? That kid knows what he wants. Lincolns. Mercedes. Acuras. Porsche. BMW? I think we're in the wrong room. Now Lexus, Lexus is pretty nice. Like I could pretty much see you in this one for sure. <laughs> Look how nice it is. That's a really nice car. You should sit in that one. Well, you kind of want a third row though, right? None of these are gonna have third rows. These are small. Yeah, this one has a third row. So this is kind of the size that you would have to get yeah. if you wanted a third row. It's still a big vehicle. Oh, it has a lot of room. Oh, how these go down? They go down with this button right here. You Are you just, serious? Yeah, you just push the button. And... Oh, that's nice. <laughs> Maybe we shouldn't look at this Lexus. <laughs> This is probably really expensive. This is really nice. Look how much room. The, the Seiko's forward really easy. How much is it? I don't know. I have to look <laughs> it up. So this one's 67 as shown. It actually does have the price. They start at 55 but this one's 67 That's doable if we get like 50000 for a trade-in for your mini man. Right. <laughs> I could talk him into it. I'll send Daniel. Okay. Daniel will talk him into it. He can drive a bargain. Let me sit in wow, it once. This is really fancy. How this, you just press look this it on the ground. Opens. Oh, look at that. Oh, wow. That's just a little flex right there when you get out of the car. At church, <laughs> you're like, pow, Lexus. <laughs> I mean, not like I would drive this anyway much. Only when we go on a date like three or four times a year. This thing's got plenty of room. I know it does. You look good. I do? Yeah. This is obviously four-wheel drive, right? This one? It's probably all-wheel drive. More than likely. It's got a turf ski in it. Man. Electric driving for short trips. Proven hybrid technology for long journeys. I heard hybrids are the way to go. Yeah, it's all-wheel drive. That's a nice car. Let's go see some it's, more nice cars. It's, it's really in the back too. Oh yeah. There you go. I'll send it to you so you can text it to the kids. Tell them that dad bought you a car. Oh, West Bend Dino Tuning. That's the place that tuned my Mustang. Oh really? Oh yeah. They have some really nice. Look oh. at this guy. Mr. <laughs> Mr. Rick, that's what I just told her when I seen you. I'm here, it's easy like, money, brother, easy money. <laughs> yeah, for you guys. Yeah. How's it going? We make... <laughs> Don't tell everybody how much we make. Somebody trying to get a car like mine with a Crown Vic? And I was like, no, uh-uh. <laughs> My Crown Vic has a supercharger. Yeah, I know. So you're, you're, out, you're out of luck if I'm, you ever I'm pull up on me. I'm ballpark, I tell you, I can't. <laughs> <laughs> it's good to see you guys. Yeah. So this is the, the rear engine Corvette. Oh. This is how they make them now. They're oh, nice cool. looking cars. I mean, it looks pretty much like a Lamborghini, but a lot cheaper. 
You can get these for like 125. This one's obviously got work done to it, or it wouldn't be here at the West Bend Dino Tuning booth. 1100 horsepower. Oh man. Yeah, I had you guys put the supercharger kit in. It was just for fun, you know, a fun car. Yeah, I still got it. Yeah, I don't drive it much. It's more of like a prop car. What are these little guys for? Um, them are off of an EcoBoost. Those are upgrade for an EcoBoost, like 2017 and up, like F-150. That's mine. How much? Give me some power. I got a 2019, the high output. Um, well, I, I'm sure we got your info, but I, I can send you a quote. I don't know the exact. Do they, have, like, they actually make much of a difference, though, like a tune in those turbos? You actually get yeah, much power so or not really? Edelbrock has a kit and Whipple has a kit. Yeah. And... Brian had just left, he's pretty up on them, but they're anywhere between like 90 horsepower to 200 and some horsepower. And I know that- That's actually impressive. Yeah. Not even 90 is impressive. Yeah. The, the 200 one is the one where they actually do replace the turbos. Yeah, just, keep, just I like to know how much it costs to yeah, put the, sure. the, we'll the to replace the turbos and the whole yeah. thing. Yeah, yeah, see ya, man. What do you think about that? New turbos on, the, on my pickup? You think that'd be okay? You do? Okay, I'll just go look at these right over here. Take your time. Yes, sir, Victory. How are you doing tonight? Good, how are you? Let me ask you something. Yeah. When's the last time you got water in your basement? Never. There's a little trickle when you were there? Nope. I've never even had a drop of water in the sump crock so far. So hopefully it'll stay that way. But nice talking with you. I gotta check out these cars over here. I only have a minute. Well, this one's for sale. This little Lamborghini right here, 17,000 miles. Oh, this is old. This is a 2011, 17,000 miles, 140K. That's an old car. I bet if you bought an old car like that, it would be nothing but problems. Here's a Ferrari. This thing would be pretty beautiful. Look at that leather. <laughs> with this little Porsche right here. I like the newer GT3s. That's what I really like. This is a 2019 911 Turbo. This was my dream car when I was a kid. When I was growing up, I dreamt about having a 911 Turbo. This is the one and only car that I wanted. I still like them a lot, don't get me wrong. I heard Porsches actually as far as like high-end sports cars have the most legroom. Like big guys can actually fit in these, which is not true of most of these cars. What we really want to look at is uh, the Ford Explorers. We want to sit in one of those because that's on the, that's near the top of our list. So, yeah, big community. So, yeah, we homeschool you guys. We do. Look at Big yeah. Ray doing his first live with the Victory Gear. Look at him. He's so happy. She said, oh, uh, going back to work. Well, I am technically back to work with him a little bit part-time right now. But like we're talking like concrete season, we're going to go in April. That's true. I'm, we're not just, I'm not Somewhere sorry, between the April 1st and the 15th, April, we're going to start. Ooh, what is that? Sorry, Big Ray, I see a car turning you off, buddy. I don't want to lose my wife, but I really want to see this Corvette. See, there's no way I could even fit in a Corvette. I'm gonna try though. I'll try to get in one of these. I highly doubt it. Man, I get so excited about cars. <laughs> I don't know why. I love them. I'm right here. Oh. Let me ask you a question. When's the last time you had water in your basement? I got it. I could work for you. <laughs> Have a good night. Did he hit you with that question? Yeah. Right away? Yeah. So I'm gonna buy this Corvette right here if I fit in it properly. With the blue one? Yeah. It looks good. Apparently there's a line to sit in the Corvette. It's not that exciting. I just want to see if I fit. Did you fit in there good? Yeah, actually, surprisingly I did. Really? Yeah. Interesting. I didn't think I was going to. Yeah. <laughs> but. Let's just come back. Cause I'm pretty sure that little kid's gonna sit in there for a while. He's dreaming big time. You don't like Chevy? Yeah. Yeah, but this is pretty nice, you have to say. 
Well, this is like a sporty edition. <laughs> There's nothing wrong with that. <laughs> this one's locked too? Why does Chevy... Lexus has their vehicles open, but Chevy locked it? Come on, it's not that special. It's a Traverse. You can't even sit in it. That's pretty much why we came here. To sit in the vehicles. Yeah, so that's it. As far as the smaller SUVs, that's the one with the third row. Maybe I want a Suburban again. Look how nice they're so big though. <laughs> and they're so expensive. Tag, no tag bags. What about a... Uh, um, a Tahoe? Yeah. What is it? Is that the Tahoe? Yeah. Right, right there, the red one. Oh, oh, the red one. You like Tahoes? No, I don't. I'm just kind of kidding. Don't tell me. Why do they lock all their vehicles? That's like why we come to sit in the vehicles. Oh, that's a high country. That's like the top trim level. The high countries are nice. It's bringing, it is nice. It's bringing back memories. Oh, these are really <laughs> expensive. I like my Let suburban. me see. 90. Ooh. This is a diesel. This has that little itty bitty diesel in it. A little Duramax. Three liter Duramax. I prefer a gasoline engine to be honest. We used to have a Suburban, a blue one. Ours was a 2006, so it was quite different, but in a lot of ways the same. Same same size, general shape, four wheel drive. Yeah, we got an hour. We're doing pretty good. Yeah. What do they even have, Honda? They have the Pilot. The, the CRV is the smaller one, I think. Yeah, the Pilot's the bigger one, though. I don't think this one is three rows either. Oh, you mean they don't make one with... I'm not sure. Oh, yeah, this one is. This one has three rows. They're just down in the back. I don't really like how this looks. No, I don't. I don't either. I think this is kind of ugly. Yeah, I think so, too. I mean, compared to the Lexus and even the, even the Chevys, I think, are nicer looking than this. Yeah. It's hard when you see the Lexus first because that, right, that's I really nice. I mean, that's Toyota's to premium <laughs> brand. I don't want to look at the Kias. A Nissan. No, I don't like I don't like Nissan Toyota. SUVs. Toyotas, yeah, we can look at a Toyota. I'm pretty sure like Ford, Chevy, or Lexus. Well, or the Toyota. The Highlander. Where's the Toyotas? These are Subarus, Volkswagen. This is actually a 6500. This is a little heavier than mine. The Trail Hunter. It's the Tacoma Trail Hunter. It's kind of weird they use TRD. I would have not used those letters. This is the TRD Pro Edition, which is phenomenal. It's got the black on black Kevlar wheels with the lift kit and the Fox shocks. It's got a stamped front skid plate and a skid The new minivan? Is it nicer than ours or pretty much the same? Man, minivans are so expensive. 50K. 50K. Yeah, it doesn't look like it's changed all that much. I mean, the center console is obviously kind of weird. Does that fold or something? Why does it look like that? It looks so weird. I don't know. It's just like minivans are minivans, you know? They're just all kind of the same. Basic. Yeah, they're all pretty much the same thing. This is the Highlander, I think. This is the other one we wanted to look at. Oh, it's over here. Yeah, this is the Highlander Hybrid. So this is actually less than that minivan. Spoiled. Oh, you gotta like, do this. Where's the button? You gotta do this manually? Yeah, oh, so come bad. on. No, I don't think that was a oh, problem. The, 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 the metal part is stuck. Well, this part's not stuck. Yeah, now the headrest is yeah, stuck on the armrest. <laughs> this thing is no good. Two problems. I just opened it and it has two problems already. Nope. Sorry. No Highlander. Doesn't seem as roomy as the Lexus. Like legs. You know? Seems like you just like the most expensive. <laughs> oh, this is the Grand Highlander. So this is more expensive. So maybe this is better. 
this is like their top trim, I think. Like this is it. The Grand Highlander. I mean, it's pretty nice. I'll say it's pretty, pretty nice. It's really nice, actually. It's really nice. I don't think this is a beautiful vehicle from the outside. I personally think this is kind of ugly. I'm just saying. Let's go look at the Jeeps and then finish with the Fords. Hyundai, these are expensive. $55,000 for Hyundai Palisade. This thing is actually kind of nice. It's, it looks good. Go sit in this one once. The seats are nice. You like it? Yeah. Huh? Uh-huh. You gonna buy one? There's a lot of hybrids here. I, I noticed that. There's a lot of hybrids. I don't love the steering wheel. No. This this looks right here, this looks really cheap. Yeah. This looks really nice. I don't, I don't yeah, I agree. I, I yeah, I agree. Steering wheels are kind of a big deal, I think. I think so too. Mercedes has some beautiful steering wheels, I will say. Mercedes. They have great steering wheels. I agree. I like the trim. I like this dash. Like this looks nice. Yeah. I like this the blue light all the way around. It's got enough room. I mean I fit. That's surprisingly this, nice. Yeah. yeah. Surprisingly nice Hyundai. Honda is coming along. They up their game. Kia up their game too. We didn't look at them, but I've seen them and they have some pretty nice Kias now. Oh, here's a Grand Wagoneer right here. Come and look at this car. Look at the American flag. Look at the interior. It's got the like old school wood grain. Look at the size of the sunroof. Massive. I'm not a huge fan of the Jeep brand, but this is a really nice car. I already know these are expensive. Whoa. How much? A uh, hundred. A hundred even? Um, a hundred ninety-five. One hundred thousand and ninety-five dollars? Yeah. <laughs> 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 wow, that's enormous. Yeah. That's huge. That could fit my garbage for like one morning. <laughs> Yeah, it's really comfortable. Yeah. I like it. It looks really nice, too. This is really expensive. <laughs> it, that is expensive. 100k even. But you get a discount at the show. You could probably get it for like 98. Why are we so impressed with that, though? Oh, you want... This is a performance car. You don't want this. Maybe I do. <laughs> oh, the SRT? We'll go sit in it. If you like it, I like it. It's not like Hellcat fast because it's it's not supercharged, but I'm sure it's pretty quick. I'm not impressed. This is ninety thousand. So Durango SRT three ninety two. So how many horses is this having? It doesn't say how many stock horsepower it has. Six point four V eight. It's gotta be. I'm gonna look it up now. I'm going 450. <laughs> Big Ray is still on. Almost 900 people on. That's that's a lot for his very first live stream. That's really good. 475. I was close. I said 450. Impressive. Did you like the Grand Cherokee? No. No, not really. That's pretty much it, except for Ford. Not really. No. no, not really. They don't have any Hellcats here. Is that a Durango? We should sit in the four. Yeah. Or I want to sit in the Corvette. And then we should go down to the Lexus again. Because then we can compare like the four to the next most likely, the Lexus. Yeah, the Explorers look nice. Yeah, they do. Really nice. Especially when it's in this display with the lighting, it looks even better. <laughs> it does. <laughs> That's why they do it. They make it look oh, like it's sitting on a throne. Here, prototype. But well, where's their non-prototype? Oh, I think back there. Let's go look at the one you can I get in. Just... Let's see. 55. Yeah, the Lexus is 67. Oh, this is the limited. This is the nice trim package. How do you open it? 
There's a button right here. Oh. It's got an arrow. Oh, I see. Nice. Oh. Oh. That was a close one. Well, that would have eliminated this from the pool. This is the limited, so I mean, we would get a, you know, something like this, the higher trim package. Yeah. It's got a tow bar because we tore fishing board up north. I would probably have these down. Most of the time, yeah. Yeah, I would. Most of the this time. Because is, this isn't like a ton of room. Yeah, but when you put them down, you I got know. a lot uh, of room. That's what I'm saying. I would probably just keep them down. Do you like it? Yeah. You do? I think I'm sold on this one. On this one? Yeah. It looks like a Ford. Yeah, I like it. I mean, there's a lot of things about it that remind me of my pickup truck. Oh, I know. Like, listen. The door locks, just what they look like, the icons. Yeah. You can just tell it's a Ford. Even in yeah. here, the USBs. I, just, I like this, though. It's comfortable. I, I like it. Yeah, the seat's comfortable. My truck is super comfortable. My pickup, I love it. Yeah. I like Ford. I like Ford too. You should start a channel and see if they'll sponsor you and give you one of these. Okay. We could just have Daniel call Ford, like the CEO of Ford. Oh, yeah. And tell him he's the CEO of Victory <laughs> and see if they want to do like a collaboration. Yeah. Well, aren't you going to get a Ford, new Ford? Yeah, but I'm going to get a Shelby. I know, but maybe they'll give us like a deal. Mm. I'm so glad you came. <laughs> he was like, come here. The Everdry guy? I think he so. called you babe? I, I, maybe. <laughs> what if I went over there and confronted him and he beat me up? You know how embarrassing that would be? <laughs> if he beat me up. <laughs> from his walker <laughs> wow i'd have to edit that out for sure that's identical to my truck it's a lot of similarities that thing is all right 57k Lindsay can't get a brand new car no 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 obviously not this thing costs a lot no, even this one costs 44 45 thousand dollars i mean you know i mean i'm i'm not loaded that guy, he's loaded. <laughs> you could tell he's loaded. Like, you can just tell. I can tell if somebody's loaded from across the room just by looking at him. He is. Look. Oh, you can tell. Let's go. By the Corvettes. These are the sketchers I found on a clearance rack for like $20. Where? And they're actually too big and I didn't even care. They were so cheap, I was like, I don't care if they're too big, I'm buying them. <laughs> and, really? Yeah, and now I'm wearing them. What? You can't pass up a good deal oh, like that. Door. I think they're at Farm and Fleet or something. They were like on they the clearance look, shelf. They look big. I know, but. <laughs> 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 they're a little big. Are they comfortable? Not really. <laughs> But they were only the 20 important. bucks. I'm pretty sure he wants it. You look good in there. Look, looking good. This thing is, you gotta go all the way back. All the way down. That's it. Right underneath. Oh boy. I'm in. The steering wheel just up. Whoa. It doesn't have no battery. Oh yeah, it does. That's it. That is odd. I am quite sure You're gonna hit the top. if the top is up. You're just gonna have your camera. <laughs> uh, I couldn't wear my camera for sure. <laughs> right. That's a problem. <laughs> well maybe the camera goes over this though. I don't know. Does anybody have a view? Maybe it'd be perfect. It's like pinching my kidneys. It's definitely too small. 
I would just have to get a Porsche because I heard Porsches have way more head and leg room. Hey, can you give me a hand? I got to get out. No, I'm just kidding. I think I can get out. <laughs> I was in my friend's McLaren once and that was terrible. I literally had to roll out onto the ground. I was like, how are you going to look cool pulling up with that? You're going to roll out onto the ground. Yeah, right? I say and the Corvette. Should we go back by the Lexus and then leave? Yeah. I think it's between the Lexus and the Explorer. Don't you? Yeah, for sure. I mean, the shape is very similar between the two. I don't, I don't love like all the black plastic trim on the Explorer on the bottom. I mean, it's not terrible, but this looks cleaner. Cause you would only have Joanna, Daniel, and Grace. You'd only need three seats, actually. Yeah. But the Ford doesn't have that either. Attention all guests. The auto show will be closing in 15 minutes. 15 minutes. Attention. I don't know. It's a tough one. So it's on this is a hybrid, right? It's on the Grand Highlander platform. This is not. No. This but one's we not. Do the gray one right to your right. That one is a performance hybrid. It's like a high horsepower hybrid version. Oh, of that looks really expensive. Faster. I mean, it's probably close to 70, but it picks up and goes. It's a lot quicker. Oh, that's what I but need. But it's still, I mean, this one's just great. Let's look at the gray one. 75. 75 for this one. Yeah. You look really good in there too. <laughs> you really do. I've never really been a fan of like the this isn't the primer gray, but this is pretty close to like a primer gray. But this one actually looks pretty good. 75k plus tax. Lots of money. Well, let's go. I think we narrowed it down to two. The Lexus or the Ford. One or the other. I mean, these look better for sure. This thing is beautiful. But the Ford might be a little bit more practical. Or we can't. And then we went no, and then we went that way. So we just gotta go this way. What's that? Check out what? What are you doing? These are brand new. I just put on these first time I ever wore them. I get it. I just want to show you my protector. Okay. It's all natural cleaner. All right. These were really expensive. How much is the kit? So is this product for for any color material, any shoes, any fabric, any hats, sofas, bags, and all Hats? Purses, sofas, couch cushions, jewelry, anything, any material, any color. Nice. It doesn't matter what it is. What you say, sir, you think I can bring your business and invest and not stress on it? I know you buy expensive shoes. Yeah, I know I do too. What do you think? I don't know. I, don't know. I think we should get it. I'm not getting it because we need it. I'm getting it because he he impressed me like thoroughly. He oh. memorized all that. He's just a good salesman. I appreciate you, boss man. Maybe seven two attacks before. Okay. And then it's gonna ask you, would you like a receipt? No, I don't need a receipt. Appreciate you, boss. All right, man. thank you, man. Thank you, yeah, you're welcome. <laughs> <laughs> That's crazy. I gave him a really big tip. <laughs> that was impressive, though. Like the show's over, there's like a couple people, and he's still still hustling. He's still trying, yeah, exactly. That's impressive. Honestly, most guys that we're gonna show, they're itching to get out 20, and when it's dead like this, 20 minutes early, they just leave. Most people do. So for him to still be like out there asking, you know, trying to get sales, that's good. Have a good night. Thank you, you too. I probably will never use this. Oh, Ryan will probably use this. Ryan that. loves stuff like this. Yeah, I know. I was thinking maybe. I think that was really like profitable. 
we eliminated having to drive to all the different dealerships. Yeah, exactly. We don't like the vast majority of them. Right. Exactly. So that was good. Yeah. Do you want to get ice cream or no? Yeah. Okay. If the Explorer drives anything like my truck, like you're going to like it. Yeah. All right, we're going to go to Culver's and get some ice cream. And then we're going to head home. That was a lot of fun, actually. I enjoyed that. Man, I love cars. A little too much. Culver's. I pretty much pay for everything. I think it's your turn for the ice cream. Oh, really? Yeah. Isn't that my, part of my birthday present though? Oh. <laughs> oh man, look at these shoes. See how they sparkle in the white? They're still too big and uncomfortable though. It didn't fix that at all. <laughs> my feet look so big. I know they do. They like, look really big. They're kind of like clown shoes. I wonder what that guy was thinking. He's probably like, why does this guy have such big feet? <laughs> He's like, I never have to use this much product. Whoa. Why is it so busy? Yeah, it's packed. Like there's a whole school here or something. What did you get? That's for the flavor. The flavor? Oh, that looks pretty good. I'm going to get a turtle sundae though. Turtle sundae? Yeah. I actually think I prefer to sit in a car. This is gonna give me a headache in here with all these kids. I like kids, but this is a little much. We'll just eat in the car. It's way too crowded in there. It's way too loud. You can't even talk in there. Me and Big Ray are gonna have an eating contest. You are? Yeah. For real? Yeah. What are you gonna do? Just see who can out eat the other. He thinks he can eat like more of, than me. Of what? I mean, doesn't we haven't like, decided. It kind of depends on what you're eating. Well, it's something we both like. Like ice cream. Not this. Not anything <laughs> disgusting. Right. No, right. not ice cream. <laughs> Just like some normal food. Yeah, maybe cheeseburgers. He can eat a lot too. I know. I'm thinking he he can. Are you ready to go? Yeah. All right. Where are they coming home from? Volleyball. Oh, hey, you guys! Daniel? You guys all went to volleyball. Wow. Hi, Grace. Hi. <laughs> Hi, Daniel. Hi, Daniel. Wow. What is that? This is he got a bear. Things. I won wow. this at the claw game at Sukasa. Oh, what? first try. First try. What is this? What is it? It's a bear. It's a bear. It's mine. How cute.